killed anyone. Statistically speaking. <laughs> See? Nothing to worry about. Huh? That's just probably the everything is fine light. Okay, but hypothetically, what if it's the everything is not fine light? <laughs> oh no! According to the JWG, we're off the tip of Greece, and... Wait, this can't be right. I thought it was a myth. What? What is this place? Ethiquac. What? Oh, 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 I always say, better safe than whatever the opposite of safe is. Yeah, I do say that. When have you ever said that? Hmm, might as well take a look around. Yeah! 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 Everyone stay on the plane! Yeah! 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 See ya, let's go! Bye-bye! We're here! We did it! Yeah! Wait, why do we do that? Dewey, this is Ithaquack. I'm sorry? Home of legendary Greek artifacts. The uh, Greek, uh, uh, what? Like the Spear of Selene. Selene! I knew it! My mom's note to Scrooge said she took the Spear of Selene. If we can find the spear. Maybe we'll find out what happened to her and uncover Scrooge's greatest mystery. To the Naos! That's Greek for temple. Okay, stop assuming I know things. Like baseline, assume I know nothing. Life is like a What could be dangerous about a beautiful Grecian vacation island? Like yeah! Ha ha! Kaya! Oh, glorious day! May the fates sing of your return, friend Donald, sailor of the seven seas! Hiya, buddy. <gasps> Be these colorful creatures your kin? By Hephaestus' hammer, half-grown heroes in the making! Um, who are you? Your uncle must have told tale of Storcules, Colossus of Corinth, hero of Heliopolis, and my proudest accomplishment, best friend to Donald Duck. The Storcules of Greek legend is your best friend? Uh, but I can't get Ha ha! Thine tongue be as quick and mighty as, well, me. <laughs> Donald, get the boys on board. We can't let him know we're here. Can't let who know we're here? Scrooge McDuck! You dare defy the will of Zeus? The king of the gods? Get out! Oh, so many questions. Do you control all storms or just lightning? Does being immortal also make you impervious to pain? Do you cry? <gasps> you know where I can find a good gyro? Always ask the locals. The myths are real! This place is amazing! It used to be amazing until Scrooge and his mortal riffraff showed up and ruined it! What? Dear Scrooge, I've taken the Spear of Selene. I'm sorry, Della. 
We are close to the truth. I can feel it. What if my mom explored this very path? What if I'm literally walking in her footsteps right now? I can still smell her feet. So we know Della took the spear of Celine and betrayed Mr. McDuck and Donald. Whoa, 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 whoa. We don't know she did something bad. That note could mean lots of things. I've taken the spear of Celine to get cleaned. I'm sorry I spilled soup on it. I've taken the spear of Celine back to the store. I'm sorry you already had one. Happy birthday! Ooh, or I've taken the spear of Celine from your money bin. I'm sorry I betrayed your trust. Or, or probably one of your things. <laughs> the only way to know for sure is in the Temple of Heroes. Of heroes? <laughs> Pretty good sign my mom wasn't a traitor. If a quack was the secret vacation spot for gods and heroes, and I was the god of hospitality, the king of the beach, everyone loved me, then Scrooge showed up, defeated the unkillable Gorgon, found the lost treasure of Troy, was really good at building sandcastles. Blah! Seems pretty fun. Twas! No, it wasn't! Scrooge showed up like he was so cool and ruined it! Oh, jings, leave it to an immortal to whine about the good old days. So where is everyone? They all left when you did. Said they didn't want to party with a lame god who couldn't even best a lowly mortal. There may have also been a year-long lightning storm. But now that you have returned, Stortules, Noble Donald, and his fiery sister, Halt! Where is Della? I see. Then we shall embark upon a rousing adventure to honor our fallen compatriot! I don't adventure anymore. What? But adventure is the very blood in your veins! Well, we must at least hold a feast to celebrate your return! Yeah! What? Father, surely the god of hospitality would not cast out a crew of weary travelers? Oh, no. I guess not. <laughs> it shall be a bacchanal for the ages! Beach party! <laughs> mm. Oh, these are the best grapes ever! A little salty? Dip not good enough for you, mortal! You offend Olympus! Maybe people didn't leave because they liked me, but because they didn't like you! Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! Perhaps some festive beach games will lighten the mood. Yes! A contest! Your family versus mine in a series of heroic trials. Yea, all will know that we are the superior party hounds and return to the island! This is exactly why we stopped vacationing here. But guys, epic trials! Zeus! Delicious grapes! You're not going anywhere. Woo! Uh, Careful! According to legend, the artifact in this chamber holds a terrible curse when removed from its pedestal. Of course! Scrooge must have been cursed by the spear. I've taken the spear, Celine, to decursify you. I'm sorry, I probably won't survive. She was a hero! This place is filled with booby traps. We have to be careful. If my mom can make it across, so can I. <laughs> it's okay. Shh. It's okay. We only have to do that one more time to get out. <gasps> It was all worth it to find the Sword of Selene! Wait, what? This isn't what we're looking for. Where's the spear? It's a big temple. We must have the wrong antechamber. Then we'll just have to find the right one. Nothing will stand in our way! The curse! Put it back! Put it back! Ah. Oh, I love these tunics. They're just so breezy, so comfortable. And surprisingly slimming! Storkiles may have brute strength, but he's also an idiot. You lads can use that to your advantage. I believe in you all. Okay, son. If you beat Scrooge's family, I'll be back on top. Admired, respected, blindly obeyed. And why do you not compete directly against Scrooge? Well, obviously, people would lose respect for me if I were to lower myself to his level. Uh, never mind that. To your positions! 
Whoever claims Aeolus's bag of wins first wins. Understood? Five or six questions. Body mark, get set. <laughs> Nephews of Donald, what ingenuity! From henceforth, you shall be known as Hubert, tamer of winds, and Llewellyn, fighter of storms! Awesome! Please do not say my real name out loud! <laughs> Satisfied? Doesn't count! They cheated! Best two out of three! <laughs> to challenge the gods of Olympus, but will probably be eaten by a sea monster. I'm sorry, Della. That's a possibility. <laughs> you hideous monster! I will avenge my mother by killing you with the very spear you are sworn to protect. You shall never get the spear of Poseidon! I'm sorry, the spear of who now? The spear of Poseidon! And we got the wrong chamber again. We're looking for the spear of Selene. Oh, you're gonna want to go back down the hall, past the Harpy Aviary, third door on your left, Garden of Selene. Can't miss it. Oh, hey, thanks. Sorry about calling you a hideous monster before. I'm sure you're very attracted by sea monster standards. Not really. Thanks, though. comes the ultimate challenge. Steal the golden fleece from this small child. This is your ultimate challenge? There's no way we're gonna beat Storkules on this one. Steal? From a child? But if I were to do such a thing, could I ever truly be called a hero? Donald, I am in need of your wise counsel. Donald? Donald! Moon companion, Donald, where are you going? Ah, uh, look, you're a nice guy, but... The most nice guy, for I am Starcules, pure of... No, 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 I'm through with adventure. Someone always gets hurt. But getting hurt is part of the adventure. What would fierce Della say if she could hear you now? Well, she can't. Ah, <sighs> someone always gets hurt. <gasps> A perfect 1 1 25th scale replica of Ithaquack. And look, there's a tiny chimera on the hillside. It's so adorable, I just want to slay it. Focus, we're so close to solving this. The truth about my mom. And one of the greatest mysteries of Clan McDuck. So do we look in the tiny houses or? Selene! What's it say? That Della Duck was a hero who died nobly trying to protect her family? Whomsoever claims the prize inside shall find great riches but incur the terrible wrath of the gods. <gasps> it all checks out! Della stole the spear, angered the gods, and brought their wrath down upon her innocent family, which explains why Mr. McDuck and Donald didn't want to land here! Ha! That can't be true. My mom would never do that to her family. I guess we'll find out for sure in the garden. Let's go. No. What are you doing? The door is closing! We're not going in. 
But all the answers we've been searching for are in there! I don't care! My mom was a hero! If I do not steal the fleece, father shall be incensed. But if I steal from a small, innocent child, how can I ever face myself again? Just grab it already! I got it! Louis! Watch, I'm also a little kid. It's fine. Ego. Plug your ears! No good ever came from a creepy child singing. Oh, the child is actually a mind-controlling siren. Did I not mention that? Storkiles, finish them! Just have to hold you up until the door closes. You wouldn't. I'll save you, Tiny Chimera! No, my fists betray my heart! Father, stop this madness! <laughs> Just lay off, man! It's not my fault I best you at pretty much everything I do! Not helping! Let me swirl, you no good! <laughs> I must apologize in advance for crushing your tiny bodies. I want you to know that as my best friend Donald's family, I consider you my second tier best friends. Farewell! We're so close to the truth. Why won't you let us find it? Because what if my mom was a bad person? Okay. What? This is one mystery we don't have to solve. I need to know the truth, whatever it is. Hey, you're not Della. You know Della? Where is she? Please tell me she wasn't an evil family betrayer and spear stealer. Who are you, anyway? Dewey, that's Selene, the goddess of the moon. Hi, I'm Webby. I heard Scrooge and his family were on the island, so I wrote a super spooky prophecy on the door to lure my friend Della. They usually does the trick. So where's the spear of Selene, Selene? What spear? The one Della took from your garden. You mean the sphere of Selene? Why does no one get what I'm saying? The spear of a Selene! I've never had a spear. Do you mean the sword of Selene? That's down the hall. No! The spear of Selene! The one my mom took! The one that's our only clue to finding her! Ah, uh, you're Della's kid! I should have realized you're just like her. I'm sorry, I haven't seen her in years, and I don't know what the Spear of Selene is. So we're back to she stole Scrooge's spear and betrayed the family then. Great. What? No way! She loved her family more than anything in the world. Oh, Della wasn't just a good person. She was the greatest, and she made everyone around her better. Maybe the spear isn't an artifact. Maybe it's something else. Your mom did love a good mystery. Here, it's not a spear, but... It is a treasure even Della never found. Don't give up, young duck. Your mother never did. Know <laughs> <laughs> that I regret this most bitterly. Ah! Seems like old times! Hey, lad! <laughs> we gotta stop the singing! I'm on it. What a magical voice! Do you have any idea how much money I could make on a voice like yours? Zeus just wants to use you. I want to use you to make us both rich. What do you say? You've got a deal.
Great. <laughs> Donald, you have saved me. Oh, come here. Don't hug the enemy. What are you doing? They're best friends. Great success. Perhaps we've been letting our pride get in the way for decades, and it's our families who suffered. What do you say? Peace? Does beating me really mean that much to you? Yes, absolutely. Ah, oh, fine. One final challenge. Winner gets all the glory. Oh, I, oh, I cannot believe I choked on the last round. Yes! I win! In your face, McDuck! I win! Say it out loud! I win! You love it! Oh, yeah, go! I win! You may think you're done with adventure, but it will never be done with you. You're a hero, whether you want to be or not. And that, what sakes, friend Scottish. He called me his friend! He said it back! <laughs> this is the most glorious day of my entire life! There you two are. Right, let's get back to the plane before he comes up with another cockamamie contest. Thanks for pushing me back there. I promise I'll never stop until we find the truth. With this sphere as my witness, I... Oh, no! should go now. Okay, I think I found the problem. 